Greetings, this is Skippy with On The Fly Photography, another Lightroom tutorial. This one, if I can keep from talking too much, is going to be really short and brief. A while back I put up a video about how to back up and transfer to another computer your Lightroom settings. Since then I have found a plugin that does this for you, makes it much, much easier, faster. Plugin Manager, it's called TPG Lightroom Backup, I'll put a link to this. You do need to register it to unlock the full functionality. Full functionality includes scheduling automa automatic backups. I'm going to learn to talk any moment now. In order to make this thing happen, you go to File, go to Plugin Extras, come down here and hit Run Manual Backup. You're going to hit the screen. At some point, you're going to tell it right here the folder where you want to put your backups at. Once you've done that, you're done. Right down here, it's going to show you the last time you've done backups, recent backup activity. All you got to do is hit OK. You're going to see up here in the upper left in the status area, it's telling you that TPG Lightroom Backup is running. I'm pulling this over from my other window. This is the folder where I drop all of my backups. You can see here my backups. They're named Lightroom 401 Config. It has the date there. Here we see the most recent one it's building. It makes these as a zip archive. It's all finished. I'm going to go inside this zip archive and show you what's inside here. Here is the camera raw folder and all the camera raw information. Here is a Lightroom folder. This is all your configuration. Here's your develop presets, or in this case my develop presets. There's all my develop presets. If you register this, it does this automatically. You can set this up to, on a regular time frame, back up all of your Lightroom settings. Because remember, if you've got your Lightroom say for example on your Windows machine you've got everything on your C drive if your C drive crashes you're gonna lose all of these templates you've created everything you've customized is gone boom so if you back this up remember if you have multiple hard drives don't back up to the same hard drive if your original data is on your C drive and your backups are on your C drive and your C drive dies then you don't have backups and especially considering how there's very little uh, the, the size of these files is very small back these up remotely use your Dropbox or something like that back them up so that even if your computer dies you've still got it and of course you can also use this to transfer this information from one computer to another you got Lightroom on another computer you want to get these presets these settings these configurations over to that computer you take the zip file you install this stuff on the other computer in the appropriate location for more details how to do that watch the other video that I will link to but I mean boom there it is it's a great, great little piece of software. Love it. Like it. And instead of liking things, if this video is helpful to you, please like it. I, I don't pimp my stuff. Pimp myself anywhere near enough. I also can't, still can't talk. I'm working on the whole talking thing. All right, y'all have a great one. Thanks so much. Bye.